Hi there, this will be an 888 reading. This is Dirk Diana from Empathic Moon 777. I hope you guys are doing well and this reading finds you in a good way. This 888 reading, you can have it as a personal reading on my website if you would like to book this one. All right, so this one that's coming through for our collective is going to be general, all right? So just FYI. Um, the personal reading will be a little bit more in-depth. But the first question here we're going to look at is what is the main issue or challenge happening in love and relationships right now? Okay, there is, the main issue um, right now or challenge is having some kind of uh, intervention with others involved. So what I'm seeing here, it's like other people are there, but other people have to be involved in this rescue or they have to be involved in intervening with something here. The teaching of the situation. What is the teaching of the situation? The teaching of the situation is having a conversation, getting on the same page. All right, so I'm getting here that um, there is not communication happening. Like it's an unknown about what's going on. There is other people here. Um, this is the challenge where everybody gets on this bandwagon here and solves the problem. The main issue, I mean, um, sorry, the teaching of the situation is about having a conversation and getting on the same page here. Um, the third question is, what is the first step in accessing progress? All right, so the first step is extension, spiritual path and awakening. So I do feel like there is an energy here having to do with um, maybe some kind of spiritual evolution here. This could be as a collective or this could be on an individual as well. Um, so the first step in ask, accessing progress is the extension, all right? So um, healing, um, going within, um, looking after self, self-care. And this is something to do with patience too. You have to have patience with this. As you awaken more, you get those understandings, those teachings, um, your guidance uh, to, to move up in your spiritual awakening. So um, different, uh, I'm getting also too with the people that might be involved with this, they might be in different areas of their spiritual path and awakening. Uh, not like saying one is more advanced, but they're in different places, right? So this is this extension is going to help uh, with, um, like I, I feel like it's a common understanding here to help with that common understanding. That's what I'm getting. Uh, the fourth question is the main helper for the situation. All right, so the main helper for this situation is having to do with something that is going on and on. So it just might seem like here, like the main helper right now may be have to, having to do with surviving, all right? Um, it says daily hustle. So I'm getting here, the main helper right now for the situation is to do what it is that you're doing, all right, uh, to survive. Um, continue to try to um, work with this energy here, like just to keep going uh, with this energy is what I'm getting here. Um, Number five, what is the most difficult part of the situation? So the most difficult part of the situation is reading, um, getting into the state of unconditional, genuine, certain love, all right? Um, I do feel here, there's two people here. Uh, it's about being fully open to this unconditional love. Um, uh, there, what I'm also getting from here is also expressing that love, this genuine love, um, believing in this love and expressing that unconditional love. 
Um, this is the most difficult part of the situation here. And the sixth question is how the teaching from number two will be resolved here with this conversation. Okay. Access granted. All right, social media, fake profile, hiding. So um, somebody might be, like the answer to this is somebody watching the internet, like they could be using a fake profile uh, they could be hiding, but they could be watching something on social media and that actually that uh, fake profile or that person that is uh, watching somebody's social media kind of hiding, uh, they're going to get some kind of information here. All right. They're going to get some kind of information about how to go about this conversation is what I'm getting. And um, the final breakthrough in this issue. The final breakthrough in this issue is somebody moving, all right? Uh, so the breakthrough of this whole scenario is somebody moving, all right? Maybe they're going to sell their house. Maybe they're going to move. This is having to do with something physical. This is an asset. This is a foundation. This foundation may be moved somewhere else or maybe a house is going to have to be sold, but that is the breakthrough, is leaving a current household in some way. That is the breakthrough of this, all right? And the next step toward a new path. Okay, so the next step towards a new path is being anchored into something. Um, uh, this could also be where somebody might be anchored down to the point where it's going to be too much for them like they don't want to be in that energy anymore so with this anchored and weighed down this might actually be um causing them to move out of the situation here okay i'm going to actually get a clarifier for this hamster wheel all right can you clarify the fourth question the main helper for this situation says hamster wheel so can you clarify All right, so yeah, so messenger of wands is an energy of passion, right? Your dreams, your desires. So it's having to do with making some kind of plans here, being creative. This is like your energy, your passion, right? What you want to have expressed. Um, the, the, the next step towards a new path, I feel, is like making some kind of plans here with this hamster wheel, all right? making some type of um, uh, plan with your passion about how to like get out of this hamster wheel, all right? And we're gonna clarify the grip, anchors way down. Thank you. Okay, so here we have the Hierophant. All right, so, um, this is about for the for the last question here the next step towards a new path is following some kind of convention or values all right some kind of very um rigid type of ethical type of program all right as it relates to being weighed down so it might be that you have to follow some kind of like good moral ethics with this weighed down is, is what I'm getting here, all right? Um, this might have to do with some kind of traditions. It could be uh, spiritual traditions, religious traditions, however way 
it resonates with you but following those types of um those types of institutions all right and um using that with um good moral ethics with this way down so it's almost like you're following a pathway to keep you in good moral standing with this way down all right that's what i'm getting here all right i'm going to get more information with this access granted access granted is the Sixth question, how the teaching will be resolved. So access granted. Can you tell me more about this access granted? Thank you. All right, so there's going to be some kind of options here. I do feel with this access granted, um, looking on the internet, looking on social media, it's going to bring about some kind of um, possibilities here um it it could bring about some kind of um wishes as well um it says here many possibilities so it's going to bring about some kind of options here as it relates to this interview and what is this interview about angels helpers and spirit the interview what is it about interview is about some kind of romantic gestures some kind of um dreaming energy here inner voice love offers messages romance sensitive spiritual beauty art uh this could be about a younger person because um the messenger of cups is can be a, a younger person um getting on the same page like having a conversation with this messenger of cups could be a younger person um who is youthful all right it could be psychic uh, but also to um they could also have a talk here about these romantic gestures so if it's, if it's about some kind of um somebody was giving some kind of gestures having a talk about that all right and then this intervention what is this intervention about Okay, so the intervention is having to do with sadness, having to do with loss, all right? So people, there's other people in the scenario, um, but the intervention is having to do with um, tackling this unwelcoming change, um, this loss, feeling uh, some kind of uh, sadness, all right? One more card with the Five of Cups. What is this sadness about? Thank you. Okay, we have the Seven of Swords here. So this is about uh, deception, all right? This is about false pretenses, sneaky betrayal, cheating, getting away, liar, looks are deceiving. So it's about getting together uh, to tackle this issue with, um, the sadness connected to being deceptive, all right? That is the main issue or challenge here that's coming through from spirit. And let, can you tell us more about the sold and the, and the reading off? Okay, what is this? What's, what needs to happen with the sold, which is the final breakthrough in the issue? Or what do you see happening with the sold as the final breakthrough? Okay, here. Having a new perspective here. Um, surrendering. All right. Awakening. Letting go. All right. Letting go of the sold. All right. So that's the final breakthrough. Just letting go and having a new perspective with the sold. All right, is the is the breakthrough here coming through from spirit? All right, all right. Um, so that's the reading, guys. I feel like I want to get one more message uh, for the viewer about this situation here. 
What do you want to tell the viewer about the situation here? Thank you. Okay, yes. Okay. What is this yes about? Yes. Okay, yes to the source of all. Okay, so I do feel like this is having to do with a, taking a higher perspective to the situation here. Um, the source of all, everybody here uh, is connected, all right? It's about balancing yourself, bal balancing the hot and the cold within yourself. Um, the source of all, everything is connected, Every part, everything is divine everybody is divine we are all connected this is what they're saying yes to all right this is what it's about thank you so much and i love you and take care